it's here the next craft box I want to say that this is March's box but don't quote me on that because yes also check out my snazzy new gloves they are from this lovely lady got it colourful she's brilliant she is just yeah she's wonderful she made me these um as a custom order for me I love them. I love them. <laughs> right, distracted. Craft box. So we've got a nice light blue box and a nice sort of navy ribbon. So we'll uh, take that off. Do you always love the gorgeous ribbon you get with these boxes. Now I don't know what this theme is or anything. I have done my best um, to kind of avoid spoilers. I do know do you know coming up soon is the the magic box and um I, I can't explain how excited i am for that i'm tempted to buy two subscriptions just to get the box twice but anyway let's open this one so oh nautical i do love as well that, that she writes the names on she takes the time to write the names on i'm not going to look at this just yet so we'll start off with these. So we've got some elements to fussy cut out. To do with the nautical theme, I quite like that. To try and straighten that a little bit. Just pop it under the box for now because it'd be nice and heavy. So what is this one? Seaside Stories is what the sticker says. Now, can I... No. Copy what I've seen the lovely Dawn do. Tip it all out and deal with the uh, deal with the sticker later. So we'll go seaside stories. Is that going to focus? There we go. Seaside stories. So first up in our paper bag, it's got a nice a sort of tan colour. We have our flowers. Yes. Do so. Oh, I love these two tone ones. So we've got this light blue and white, or darker blue and white, should I say? A baby blue and white, smaller baby blue and white. We have oh, ooh, that's a nice, unique, different type of flower. And then a blue and a white. They are gorgeous flowers, and I really like that we've got something a bit different as well. Mm. Thank you very much. Then we have a bottle of blue something. Some form of spray. That, oh my god, look at the shimmer on that. I don't know, yeah, the camera does pick it up. If I give that a shake. Can you see all the swirl? Oh my gosh. Look at the swirling on that. Oh, that is gorgeous. Do I have anything that I can test it out on? The back of my hospital letter because I don't need that to be um, functional. <laughs> so what is this? I'm going to assume it's a mica spray or a shimmer spray or something. Oh look at that. I don't know if the camera is showing how much that is shimmering in the light. That is stunning. Whoa, it's all over my fingers as well. <laughs> that is, hello darling. You come to be nosy, have you? <laughs> That's my cat smudge. Basically, there's a box and she wants to know what if she can fit in it. <laughs> is normally how it goes. She likes boxes. Oh my God, that is, that is gorgeous. I mean, I don't know if the camera is picking that up. I might have to do a close-up on that at the end. Oh, that's gorgeous. I'll leave it there to dry. So next we have... Okay, I'm not sure what's supposed to be in this particular thing. Maybe both together. So we've got some gorgeous coloured purple caviar beads. Look, they match my gloves. <laughs> so some caviar beads, which are great. And then we've got these two little... I'm going to take them out of the bottle so that I can show you. So we've got one that says dream 
and one that says love with the heart in a little bottle now these bottles are brilliant for lots of things so very excited about that and i love this paper look that gorgeous underwater backing for a card or something oh. i love that they are switching over to more paper bags than plastic but i do love these backing sheets <coughs> so next in a light blue paper bag and, oh that might be some uh, some resin pieces, some form of cabochon. What we got? Jing jing! Look at me. Some lovely white resin shells. They're gorgeous. Then we have dreaming of the sea. We've got four little metal. Charms. Dreaming of the sea. They're lovely. <clears throat> then oh, oh wow, these are gorgeous. Some three D shell charm. They are. I mean, that is just gorgeous. Ooh. Then we've got. Do you know what? I've just done a beach um, trinket tray, and I was thinking of doing another big beach scene. So this is going to be amazing. I've just spotted what else is in the box. So what we've got in here, more charms. So we've got some oh, little mermaid scale pieces. So we've got three pinkish yep, hearts and the four blue circular pieces. They're gorgeous. All the little um, mermaid scales on, or fish scales, I guess you could use. But mermaid scales then we've got some little mermaid charms not the little mermaid but some mermaid charms we've got this entire thing of shells now these are stunning and you've got to look at the size difference Even tiny ones and big ones so that's going to fill so much i think one is I've got one in one piece of a shell but everything else is intact that is incredible just the sheer number in that is incredible. Thank you so much, Anna. Then we have some, ooh, mermaid style glitters. This is like perfect for some of the stuff I was thinking of doing. So we have a Dreaming of the Sea snip art piece. Wooden piece, love that. We have a very nice snip art stencil with an anchor and <coughs> the red and white, um, Thing. Give me a sec. Lighthouse. <laughs> Sorry, my brain is not functioning today. That's really pretty. Then we've got some snip art anchors that will come apart. They are absolutely stunning. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I don't even know which way up I like it. Oh, too many choices. Gorgeous snip art frame with some lovely shell details on them that is lovely and then oh my are you serious okay so we have another entire paper pad oh. so this is um c backgrounds 16 sheets 250 gsm that is an incredibly sturdy card i mean I'll take the cover over but if you just listen Like, I make my mini albums with 300 GSM card as the actual building blocks of it. So 250 is amazing. So, let's get this so we can see. So we've got this gorgeous one with the C lapping up on the rocks. So we get two of those. Look at this with the water on the sand. That's stunning. And I see, yeah, we get two of those. Ooh, I like that. The blue, I love wood like wooden style anything um <clears throat> any sort of wood background wood grain i love so so we've got that with the shells on then we've got two of those then we have the actual waves themselves two of those a much calmer sea two of those 
uh, a sort of underwatery one with the the light ripples. That's stunning. And just to confirm, we get two of those. Then we've got oh wow, the rocks under. Oh my god. Okay, so many ideas. My craft room needs to be sorted so that I can do these. I've been clearing it out. Um, I'm so excited. That's a gorgeous one of the water. I mean... <laughs> so, A, the craft box is so reasonably priced. I cannot, I cannot tell you how reasonably priced this is normally. But to then get an entire paper pad of this quality of this thickness is incredible thank you Anna thank you craft box this is just right now we can go through and have a look at our list and see so number one full paper pad this is why I don't look at this first I like the, the surprise so yes a full paper pad of beautiful I think the wood grain is still my favorite although I do like this this one I'm torn torn you know this is really pretty and calm but wood grain but then this one as well just with some fish oh anyway i digress so full paper pad number two snip art anchors they're gorgeous and you've got five of them with different sizes and the nice thing is is you can use them as a stencil you can use them as a as a multi mixed media piece you can use them so many different things then snip art stencil, lovely stencil. I don't know that I would use this so much. I suppose you could use it sort of in a grey or a black as a background of something. Hmm, might have to look for some inspiration for that one. Snip art frame, which I think is just incredible. I want another one of these, or three or four actually. <laughs> if anyone wants to swap a stencil for a frame, you know. In case you need two stencils, that's a stupid idea, Laura. Um, snip Art Sentiment, Dreaming of the Sea. I love that. I think I'm going to make myself a box. and Maybe a, a, a box of beach-themed things so that when I'm doing my uh, resin pieces, well, I've got all my beach things together. I don't know. Too many ideas. Charms, which I'm assuming are both the mermaid and the shell and the... No, the tags are further down. <clears throat> okay, glitter. I mean, this glitter is just... Uh, I'm hoping the camera is picking up the gorgeousness of it. My only qualm is it's a nightmare to use in these bags. Um, But I do have some little pots, so I will decant that into a pot because um, it is a bit of a nightmare to use in, in those. Uh, shells, I mean, I can't even... That's uh, such a huge amount of shells. That is incredible. Um, resin shells, which were the four white resin shells in here. Um, sea charm tags, so that's going to be those because those are like the tags, Dreaming of the Sea. Yep, Dreaming of the Sea. And we've got the two tags that are in here, don't forget. Shell charms, which are these ones. Oh, hold on right so this is message in a bottle mini set then we've got our shell charms then we've got turtle charms are these supposed to be turtles and i've not noticed no hmm so i wonder if i've got these instead of the turtles maybe because I don't have a turtle unless I am completely blind. I don't think so. I've gone through everything. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm not fussed because these are gorgeous. But I'm intrigued now to see what the turtle charms are like. Then we have, yes, the blue shimmer spray. And this wasn't listed. The, the, caviar beads so I'm wondering if maybe turtle charms I didn't get and I got this and and the other charms instead I'm not fast because I freaking love these 
although they don't quite go with the the color theme but i don't care um and then the last thing flowers i mean i and this gorgeous blue tissue paper that once i get the sticker off carefully can be reused and then this lovely blue ribbon as well i am i am amazed at this it is i just can't explain how good value for money this is and it's such a good box with a magnetic thing oh and don't forget the fussy cut sheet i'd forgotten about that as well so extra elements i mean yeah i just mm, i love it i absolutely love it i think that anna has once again outdone herself now i'm gonna i'm gonna pause and i'm gonna move the camera to somewhere slightly more sunny to see um if you can get the full effect so i've just popped you on the kitchen table or the side table because there look at that you can see the full shimmery effect now of that spray but even even the camera isn't picking up how amazing it is and how fine the spray is i mean that is just oh love it anyway there we go i didn't want to move you um while recording because i know that makes some people feel quite sick but yes here we go the do you know i didn't even check did it say which month it was march yes it is the march craft box so very very happy with that that is just i mean i'm kind of lost for words at how much is in there again well done anna that is yeah absolutely love it thank you very much for spending time with me today guys keep safe keep crafting i'll see you soon bye